Welcome to Lawyer Flash, I'm your host John Deere and I explain the law. This week, a story about a little Friday night poker game put together by me. So I invited a few friends over for a friendly Friday night poker game. And whenever you invite friends over, especially if you're a lawyer, there's always that one person. In this case, that one person said, I'd love to come, but is poker legal? I don't know. So here I am on my weekend spending my personal time finding out whether a friendly game of poker is legal. The challenge is there's no one set of rules that covers every state. Each state has its own gambling laws and most states look at it just a little bit differently. Nevertheless, there is some commonality between the states in terms of how they treat poker. Generally, gambling is prohibited or highly regulated in every state in the country. There are a few types of gambling that are generally exempt from this prohibition. For example, many states have passed laws allowing state lotteries, usually under the guise of supporting education. Next, many states have Indian gaming casinos. This is a matter of federal constitutional law, and the states cannot prohibit them. As a result, many states have passed laws allowing it so that the states can actually tax the gaming revenues. There's another layer of gambling, sometimes called social gambling, and this includes bingo and card games put on by your church or other charities. Many states allow this kind of gambling as long as they're conducted by nonprofits and they're low stakes games. And finally, we get to the friendly Friday night poker game. As in other areas, laws vary by state. Nevertheless, most states allow these poker games if you follow these three rules. Number one, the game must take place in a private home or in a few states, a private social club. Number two, the homeowner or host cannot make any money on the deal. In other words, no buy-ins, no admissions, nothing that goes to the host of the game. And finally, all players must be treated the same, no special advantage to any player. Under these limited circumstances, most states will allow a friendly poker game. A few states, like Maryland, flat out ban any poker games. But even Maryland is trying to change that this year and has proposed new legislation to exempt in-home private friendly poker games. To sum it up, if it really is just a friendly poker game, if the host is not making any money on the deal, and if all the players are treated fairly, then in most states, it's a legal poker game. That's our show for this week. Everyone goes home a winner. You can find us here each week at lawyerflash.net or youtube.com. Also, be sure and like and share our Facebook page and mostly subscribe to this YouTube channel. I'm your host, John Deere, and I'll see you right here again next week on Lawyer Flash. Be sure and check out these other exciting Lawyer Flash episodes.